In this video, we will be talking about the input and output characteristics of the common emitter configuration of a transistor. Now, what do you mean by the input characteristics of any transistor? Let it be common emitter, common base or common collector configuration. Generally, the common uh, input characteristics is defined as the change in input current with change in input voltage when the output voltage is kept constant. That is, by keeping the output vol voltage of that particular configuration constant, we vary the input voltage and input current and we check how they are varying this uh, and the graph between the input current and input voltage for a given value of output voltage is known as the input characteristics now we are considering the common emitter configuration we already know that for the common emitter configuration the common the common junction or the common terminal is emitter and the input what is the input current base is the input and the input current is IB and the input voltage is the voltage between base and emitter and that voltage is given as VBE. So this VBE is the input voltage of an input voltage of the common emitter configuration. Now what is the output voltage? For a common emitter configuration collector is the output. So collector is the output therefore collector the output voltage is the voltage drop between the collector and the emitter and it is written as VCE. Therefore, the output voltage is written as VCE. Therefore, the input characteristics of a common emitter configuration is defined as the change in input current IP with change in input voltage VPE when the output voltage VCE is kept constant. Now, for that, when we draw the graph for input characteristics, IP is taken on the y-axis, VBE is taken on the x-axis. Now, we can observe that when we increase VBE, IB remains 0 and after a particular value, the IB finally increases. Suppose VCE is equal to 0 for this case. When VCE is equal to 0, the graph is like this. Now, for in order to draw the next graph, we change VCE by a small value. Suppose VCE is equal to 2 volt. Then the graph would be like this. We start from uh, the current will be 0 at uh, small values of VBE and it will in, uh, become 0. And after a particular value, starting from the same point, the current will increase in a different direction. This is the second input characteristics for the given value Vc is equal to 2 volt. In this manner, you can draw large number of graphs for different value of Vce. So this is how you draw the input characteristics of common emitter configuration. Now let's move to the output characteristics. Before moving to the output characteristics, one more point is that the input characteristics always resembles the in, uh, forward characteristics of a normal diode. Now when we talk about the output characteristics of a common emitter configuration or any other configuration, it is defined as the change in output current with change in output voltage for a constant input current. So in the previous case for input characteristics, output voltage is kept constant. But in, in output characteristics, input current is kept constant. So we already know that when we draw a graph here, it would be like this. We know the output current, output current is equal to IC for common emitter configuration and output voltage is equal to VCE and the input current is equal to IB. Therefore, the graph will be between VCE and IC. So, IC is drawn on the Y axis and the output current, output voltage VCE is drawn on the X axis. Now, for a given value of IB, let IB is equal to some uh, 40 microampere. So, uh, let us take this 20 microampere, very small value of IB. So, for 20 microampere IB, we check the graph, the graph would be like this. Initially, the current will be slightly increasing and after some time, it will be saturated. This is for IB is equal to 20 microampere. Now, 
Suppose we change IB to 40 microampere, then the graph will be starting at the same point like this and it will be increased to a slight height and again it will be a saturated. Like number the graph is the points alarm same but she has slightly end lighting in a room heighting in increase on the area. This is IB is equal to suppose this is to an IB is equal to 40 microampere. Either 60 microampere. Angane, number in the um, EIB value in Martin the answer chair, graph in the uming an eye to Kudi Kodi Pogum, or particular point Kayambala and the itamarum, saturated itamarum. That is, even if you increase VC, you VC increase a dalum, IC and the jaila, or an apothecary increase jaila. That is the point of saturation. So, this is the input and output characteristics of a common emitter configuration. So in the next topic we will be talking about the transistor as an amplifier in common emitter configuration. Thank you.